You've got quite a few nominations, haven't you, Emily? Yeah. Tell us what you're up for. Um, I'm up for uh, Best Female, uh, Best Album, Best Single, um, with uh, the one with Labyrinth and Next to Me. So it's a really good, good feeling. How does it feel to be kind of on top and leading the nominations in this kind of way? Uh, it feels great, a bit scary, because you never know, you might, you might not win anything, but I feel, it feels great to have this acknowledgement and recognition. To kind of come back here a year after winning Critics' Choice and, and to be nominated is, is really, really cool. It's been an incredible 12 months for you. What have the highlights been? Um, goodness, um, the Olympics, I felt very proud to, to be a part of that and to, to represent my country, you know, I felt um, it was a real highlight for me. Getting to release the album is something that I've been working towards for like four years now, so releasing an album and to, for it to be received like this is, is a big, big highlight. And now, what is so special about the Brits compared to other award ceremonies, as far as you're concerned? Um, well, the Brits, you know, it's an institution, and it, and it acknowledges music from, from so many different genres, and whether you're commercially successful or you're just a, a fantastic artist, and, and they just recognise people and, and really see something at the very beginning, like they did with me, and um, something I've watched just for years, so it's, it's wonderful to, to be here. So you were one of those kids that grew up watching the Brits oh, every yeah. year? Absolutely, dreaming. I remember seeing, you know, it thinking one day I'll be up there so um, it's, it's a like dream come true. Of course last year you won the Critics Choice Award you knew going into the ceremony you'd won this time you're going in with all these nominations not knowing how it's going to turn out is yeah. that going to feel much more pressured? Yeah it's going to be a lot I'm going to be a lot more nervous this time um, but we'll see you know fingers crossed positive thoughts and, and we'll see what happens.